Hi everybody! So I'm really really excited that Hayley has asked me to get involved in their Maker's Swap this year. Um, so we came up with a couple of ideas, we both really like bees and flowers, of course absolutely obsessed with flowers and lovely colours. So we came up with this, uh, this, this design and Hayley has printed it with using her Happy Fabric Final. Um, onto this lovely banner here. So she's used different types and I love this one. It's sort of like, I think it's the flock. My happy fabric knowledge there. Um, and I just absolutely love it. So now what I can do to this is I can embroider and embellish all over it. So I'm very, very excited. So instead of just going straight in with my heat erasable pen, um, I am going to take a picture of it and pop it onto Procreate. So I've got my iPad, my pen, my absolute life. And this means that I can just have a nice little doodle onto the picture um, rather than doodle all over this lovely banner and decide that I absolutely hate it. So I'm gonna have a little doodle. Um, so here we go. Okay, so I've had a little doodle. I think I know what I'm doing and where I'm going with it. So now I need to choose my colours. So I literally have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven boxes. Um, so I usually use my DMC ones. So DMC, trusty DMC, for any kits that I'm making. Um, and they stay separate in one box and then obviously when I'm having a little bit of fun I use unbranded ones because I don't need to buy any more of them. Okay so let's have a little flick through some colours. So I have traced my design onto the fabric here um, and I've used a heat erasable pen so that means that after if I decide that I want to change anything then I will just hair dry it um, and it'll be gone. So I've had a little play around with a couple of stitches and I would like to do that before I show you how I'm going to do it in case I decide I absolutely hate the stitch. So I have played around with this sort of detached Kind of think it's similar to a satin stitch really it's very very simple and then i've got a couple of little blue lazy daisies so i'm going to show you how to do those two stitches now and i may have a little play around with some of the stems here so i'll probably use um a bit of a back stitch to do those but i will show you now so enjoy Now I'm going to do the rest of this in front of the TV because it is much more comfortable and I will be back and show you what I have done.